are, are going difficult and their struggles. Are you happy with the way that the team is responding to this and maybe not holding your head and, and, and getting back to work? I mean, yeah, it's been very difficult times. But, um, the way we come out of play, but we I feel like we play hard just one or two plays that stop us from winning the game each and every week. And we got to minus those mistakes, become that team that we need to be. For you making some big plays in the second half, is it kind of a weight off your shoulder and, and being able to, to, to make those plays? I mean, yeah, I've been waiting to make big plays for for a little minute now. I mean, it's a new QB QB change in this. It's a hard situation with um, James, but he's coming into his own and becoming a great quarterback. Do people kind of not understand how difficult that can be? Working with a new quarterback and just, especially a, a young quarterback, and just some of the little things that have to be different. I mean, yeah, it's, it's very difficult. Um, having friends who I work on him all summer or two years straight, well, all my life really. Then um, having a new quarterback, James, he's a good dude, great guy, and um, it's, it's it's difficult coming from high school, straight out of high school, becoming a starting quarterback in college. But um, I think he's coming along very good. With that said, and it's kind of a month into this now. Do you see a, a big difference in him in practice and, and, and now in, in games and what he's able to do and what he's what he's able to see? Yeah, the way he carries himself, you could tell he's getting more confidence. And every day of practice, he's becoming more vocal, more vocal leader, and um, starting to take more charge of the offense. In two weeks in a row, he's, he's looked really sharp in the fourth quarter. It, is it important now to kind of see him transfer that to, to early in games and maybe get into it? To, help get the offense into a rhythm early? Yeah, that, that's been um, our recent struggle, starting off very slow, coming out of the second half, trying to come back and win or take the lead or anything like that. I feel like we need to come out more stronger first and second, first and second quarter and um, put put our foot on people's throats. Duke, a very aggressive defense. They like to, to blitz. Uh, do you feel like get some good blocking that there's opportunities for, for some big plays against against Duke. Oh yeah, yeah, I have a lot of confidence in my O line. I love those guys. Those guys work hard every day. Nobody sees what they do what they do off the field. But um yeah I think there's gonna be a lot of big, big plays to be made in that Duke game. Well with Ricky now ten straight field goals this year, how much confidence do you guys have in him and, and do you guys feel that when you guys get into scoring range knowing that you, you're gonna get those three points at least? I mean having a kicker like that yeah Get it in scoring range. It's very important to have a kicker that can uh, knock, that, knock those field, field goals down. And uh, with Ricky, he's gaining confidence each and every week, so that's that's very good. You mentioned DeAndre and kind of playing with him his whole life. How, how tough was that on you seeing him go down and, and, and how close you are to him? It was very tough. When he went down, I thought he was going to get right back up like he always do. But after I seen him um, laying on the ground for about three, four minutes, I was like, man, he really hurt. Something really wrong. And it really touched me. It hurt me. How have you seen him respond to this? Are you kind of happy with how engaged he's been with the team and, and being around and how he's handling everything? I mean, he responded um, pretty well. I mean, it's tough to respond to something like that, but um, he's handling it all right. And um, he's uh, taking charge and uh, helping Jay Black. He's he been the sidelines, um, encouraging Jay Black and what to do, what not to do, and stuff like that.